welcome back to my canal. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, boom! You already know what's coming. I know you guys, you know, that's probably why you clicked on this to begin with, but PR haul, uh, when is, where, what month are we in? September? No, October. October, October 2018. Oh my god, October 2019, wow. <laughs> wow, my hair is like kind of looking like Rachel from Friends, I'm not gonna lie, and like I'm kind of living for it. Anyways, October 2019, PR! <laughs> Coming at you, hot and heavy, you know what I'm trying to say. But, well, this is a little different. This PR haul, which I've never done before, but this PR haul is partnered. I just heard like something at the door and it's kind of scary. Anyways, I teamed up with Elf Cosmetics to bring you this PR haul because I was part of their new brand campaign and it was perfect timing because they actually sent me dun, 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 Elfing Amazing, this little Elf PR box. So I want to open this first, um, you know, in celebration of the whole campaign, which I was honestly so excited to be a part of. Like, you know, we were part of the Brow BFFs campaign and this campaign this year. So, I mean... Me and Elf are getting kind of tight, you know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this. I have a helper. Jeffrey. <laughs> He's a little camera shy. <laughs> he, oh. <laughs> okay, he's a little camera shy, but anyways. Um, we're gonna start, yes. I'll link his channel down below. <laughs> All right, let's do this. <laughs> oh, we did it! We did it together, guys. You guys pushed me through that one. You pushed me through, you made me through, you, you got me through. We got a lot of good stuff, a lot of good stuff to show you guys. First and foremost, this. Little baby. They basically just sent over some of their most iconic products ever. And honestly, a lot of these are products that obviously you guys have seen me use and love and everything. And I can say, like, one thing that I love about e.l.f. is I feel like their formulas are always improving. And that's definitely one thing that I'm looking for, you know what I mean? When I'm looking for products, even drugstore products, like, I don't want you guys to spend $5 on something if it's not gonna work. I want you guys to spend $5 on something that's gonna be bomb as something that's $50. So, that's, like, what I've found with a lot of the products that I've come to now, like, love and use in my everyday makeup routine that are in this box. So, first and foremost, I need to show you guys this. I've talked about it before in some of my videos, but it's called the e.l.f. Hello Hydration Face Cream. And it is... <coughs> this thing fell out. Oops. But it smells so bomb. If you have dry skin, if you like the moisture moisture, I love anything hydrating um, as far as like my skincare or even primers. I'm just gonna put some on right now because I mean like I'm not wearing makeup anyway, so like I might as well. I do that though. I will literally hydrate my skin through the day so that it stays hydrated at all times and I love the feeling when my skin feels kind of like I don't know plump I want to say moist but I know moist is like kind of a weird word to use but you know what I'm trying to say it feels hydrated it feels good it feels Gucci it is one of the most iconic products for me personally from elf because it's literally it's $12 so they uh, they put the prices on this little thing and I, I guess I'll just list all the prices or tell you guys all the prices because um, I usually in my PR hauls in general like to go through most of the information that they give us just so you guys have the information so this is 12 bucks but I'm telling you it works just as well as high-end like moisturizers and hydrators and all that but it's very affordable obviously for the quality and that's what I look for with drugstore products so that's our first one hello hydration face cream bomb.com we also have this mineral infused face primer hopefully this is in focus I can really never tell if it is but it's a clear formula and it just smooths over the skin it helps create like that obviously smooth base for your uh, foundation to lay on top of, and that's also $6. Then we have their Flawless Finish Foundation, which they sent me three different shades. This is $6 each, which is like a 
bomb deal for foundation, obviously. I have maple, which is tan with golden olive undertones. Cashew, which is medium with olive undertones. And then this one over here is called suede and it's medium tan. Oh my gosh, I have some of the moisturizer all over my fingers. No! Anyways, over here we have suede, which is medium tan with a golden undertone. So they have different undertones. I usually do go with the olive, olive undertones. Let me just swatch these for you real, real quick. Ooh. Okay, I tried to get like kind of fancy with these swatches. Um, and it looked really cute at first, but it's kind of dripping into each other. But these are the three shades. I think I'm probably closest to the middle one just because that does have that like really strong olivey tone. Um, but yeah, this is a nice foundation if you're looking for something that's like kind of in between matte and glowy. It's gonna have a satin finish. You can't beat the price, so skirt, skirt. Okay, and this one I know you guys have seen me use a ton and heard me talk about, but it's their 16 hour camo concealer, which I feel like really is one of their most like Someone's trying to play me out there. Anyways, uh, I really do feel like this is one of their most, most, most iconic products. Something that they're very well known for and just something that's become like kind of like a cult favorite, I would say, um, because it's just so bomb. It's $6, like I said. All the prices are obviously really good. Um, but you, like for a long time, I feel like the drugstore was lacking a good full coverage concealer. And when I found this one, I just kind of was like, okay, okay then. So again, they sent me three shades, so I'll swatch them for you guys. Normally, I use tan sand in this concealer, but they sent over medium peach, which is right here. Medium sand, which has just a little bit more of a pinky undertone. And then tan sand. This is the one that like I would say I used use most often. Has a really, really nice undertone if you have under eye circles that you want to cover, because this one has like a pretty strong peachy, warm peachy undertone. Is it focused? There we go. It has a pretty strong peachy warm undertone, but that's what I really like about it because it just covers up like any darkness, any, 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 anything that I want to cover really well. So we got those three shades of camo. Ba -ba -ba. 16 hour <laughs> concealer. I don't know. You guys tell me what are you, like, do you guys try, have you guys tried these products? That's what I'm trying to say. Couldn't get the words out there for a second. Um, because I know for me, like, um, whenever I feel like there's like a hero product or anything like that Like I'm more tempted to try it or try the brand or whatever So let me know in the comment section if you've tried any of these out or whatever Okay, okay, we've got elf lip lacquer, which is a clear gloss Which is obviously so handy to have you could literally use it on its own with nothing or you can put it on top of any other lipstick for just like some added shine and I like this one because it's not like it's not super thick, if that makes sense. So if you are layering it, it works out really nicely just to, again, add that shine. We also have this eyeliner from e.l.f. So this is their H2O Proof Eyeliner. It has a nice, fine pen tip so you can get like some precision with it. And then they also included their Flawless Face Brush. Boom. Let's just show you. Okay, back to our unboxing. Down here we have the e.l.f. Uh, Poreless Huddy Primer. Oh, it feels crazy. Oh my gosh, it literally feels like, I wanna say like, almost like a tacky butter feeling. Like it's super smooth. I just put it all over. It sank in really, really smooth into the skin and it gives like a blurring effect even over my, my little hand, pores and wrinkles. <laughs> Um, <laughs> and this is their primer infused blush and this is in the shade always rosy this is a bomb blush you guys if you want something that's gonna actually last obviously because it has primer inside of it so it can last longer on the skin but also it just it feels so good it feels so good when you swatch it it has the perfect amount of pigmentation um i don't really like blushes that are like Bam like in your face. You know what I mean? This is like a nice Soft soft tone soft blush really really pretty formula as well and both of those the primer um, And the blush were both six dollars and then this guy is also six dollars. So this is their Metallic flare my nails make it so hard to get some out of PR boxes sometimes This is their metallic flare highlighter and then when you swatch it you guys are 
about to be shooketh. Okay, shooketh. Do you see how how metallic that is? Like it's crazy. Okay, that's that's crazy. That's kind of crazy. But yeah, thank you to Elle for sending us over and obviously just like partnering with me so many times this year. I feel like they've been such a great partner for me and such an amazing brand that holds a lot of the same values as I do, if that makes sense. So I'm just really grateful that like I get to work with them and stuff. So yeah, thank you, Elf. Next up, I'm actually really excited to open this. I've been waiting to film this PR haul so I could open this. So this is from House Laboratories, which is Lady Gaga's new makeup line. And what we have in here, ooh, she looks so pretty. It says, all are welcome in our house. And when you open up the package, so pretty you can see like my entire little setup here I'm literally on my balcony well I'm like in front of my window at my balcony with a ring light because the Sun's not facing this direction right now with my little camera in the middle oh my god oh my god no I just friggin no oh my god all right take two so in here um, it looks like we have da -da -da, the complete collection of products so I believe these are lip colors, lip liners, the eyeshadows, question mark. I think they're like cream shadow. Actually, no, they're called like liquid shimmer powders. I think these are the product that you can use anywhere on your face, lips, eyes, or cheeks, which is actually really cool. And I just love what, um, you know, what Gaga is standing for with this line. I actually attended the launch party, which was really cool because we got to meet her and she is, she is so like, What's the word like present and um down to earth when you meet her like, i was a little shook so like i got like very um what's it called i got very like like almost overwhelmed i want to say like i kind of like didn't know what to do and you know what i mean like i i just kind of like froze that's the word i froze up um but it was still a really cool experience like she you can tell she cares a lot about this brand um, and about just kind of like putting across the message that you can be whoever you want to be with or without makeup and it's it's cool I, I think it's really cool to see how she's evolving and see how the brand evolves too okay so let's watch okay so here we have the glam attack liquid powder shadows they're a very different formula than anything I've tr I've seen or tried um, because they're super like Thin and liquidy okay and then you guys know I'm like obsessed with lip liners so these are the RIP lip liners this one looks so pretty this is the shade in point Ooh, <gasps> that is so pretty you guys oh my gosh I'm actually really try excited to try all of the um, lip liners just because that's like personally one of the products that I like weirdly collect and like just love trying and having and using. Um, these are the glosses. So these are the Le Riot lip glosses. Okay, this applicator is actually really interesting because it has this like point to it. So we have Attitude, Corset, and then this guy over here is called Scream. And then we have Venus and Entranced up there. So yeah, thank you to House Labs for sending this over. Um, I'm definitely gonna be trying them out and some tutorials coming up. So stay tuned, my friends. <laughs> I'm so excited for this, you guys. You don't even know. So what this is, dun -dun -dun -dun. this is actually um, like a skincare refrigerator. Um, and it has a bunch of products from Drunk Elephant, which Drunk Elephant is kind of a, a, a bit of a pricier brand, I would say. But whenever I use their products, I'm not joking, I see a really big change in my skin. Um, a lot of you guys may know, but also look at this. This is the cutest little friend. Are you joking me? It's so cute. And it's like, like a nice little coral shade not that anything in my apartment is coral but you know if it was it would be super cute and like fun but yeah honestly i'm really excited for this so thank you to drunk elephant for sending that over but we have the tlc sukari baby facial so this is almost like an exfoliating facial i'm sure i'm sure you've seen people use this um but it's really nice because it exfoliates the dead skin cells it leaves your skin the next day feeling super duper soft and you only have to do it like 
you know once a week if even yeah it says it recommends once weekly it's good because even if you have sensitive skin I think your skin will be able to handle this. Um, then they also have some serums in here. The C Tango, oh no, this is an eye cream, sorry. C Tango Multivitamin Eye Cream. We have the uh, TLC Framboose Glycolic Night Serum, the C Firma Day Serum. And then in the second little box down here, we have their cleanser. This stuff is so bomb, you guys. This is their B5 Serum. If you have dry skin, I'm telling you, and I know I'm sorry I'm talking to like all my dry skin girls and guys out there so much, but honestly, Honestly, I've been dealing with I've been dealing with such dry skin that I can't help but like try to recommend products for obviously what I've been personally dealing with but this hydrating serum is life-changing okay life changing like a metamorphosis will happen B5 is great to put on dry skin because it's gonna help your skin keep the moisture locked into your skin all day. But this one I feel like is a little thicker than most uh, B5s. A lot of B5s just sink right in. This one kind of like stays on the skin and keeps it feeling plump, you know? Then we have their SPF. And finally, one of my other favorite products that they sell, uh, which is their Virgin Marula Luxury Facial Oil. Again, dry skin, I'm sorry. If you have oily skin, I'm so sorry. Um, I'll try to recommend some other products that I love because I used to have oily skin, so that's why I'm like, I don't know why my skin has all of a sudden turned super dry, but if you're looking for an oil, here it is. I'm not gonna say it again. I'm not gonna be like for dry skin anymore through this video, okay? Because I've said it enough times. You guys, y'all know I have dry skin at this point. In other words, I was just gonna say, how cute is this? Um, but yeah, thank you to Drunk Elephant for sending over this, all of this. Okay, sorry guys, I like, I was getting really hot, so I had to take my sweatshirt off, um, or my hoodie. <laughs> Anyways, um, okay, so next up, ah! I've never received KKW Beauty in PR. So this is actually a very exciting moment for me. Um, so this is the KKW Beauty Winnie Harlow collab. The packaging is so beautiful. I said beautiful, but I meant beautiful. Um, yeah, this packaging is beautiful and very unique, I would say. Also just like, look at them, those two goddesses. They're just living their best best lives there, looking beautiful as ever. So this is the KKW and Winnie Harlow eyeshadow palette. You have a lot of neutrals, there's a lot of shimmer tones, and actually a lot of like plums and browns in here. I wanna swatch one of these. That actually felt a lot, oh my gosh, that is so buttery and pigmented. That was literally like, Nothing. Okay, I need to swatch this red, like, wine shade because that's gonna be... Okay, I'm not joking you, that was one swipe. Like, literally one swipe of my finger. I didn't go back over it, like, you know, multiple times. That was one swipe. Oh my gosh, the shimmers, like, it's weird. Not weird, but it's, it's interesting because in the pan, um... I don't know, they don't look like they're gonna be like buttery, if that makes sense. But when you feel these shimmers, they feel like literal butter. That one again, I literally just did one swipe. I didn't go back over it over and over again. So you can really see you get that pigment immediately from this collection. I'm so excited. So I have to create some looks with that. Um, and then let me show you guys the other products as well. Actually, should I swatch like all of the shades? of the eyeshadow. Should I? If I have time? I have a doctor's appointment in like, I have a doctor's appointment in like an hour, but honestly, I'm just gonna try to do it because I actually wanna see what all the shades look like, like laid out. Wow, so beautiful. They did honestly such a good job with the color range. Not only that, also the formulas, like, dang, girl! I'm also wearing my skims. Okay, she is trendy. Wait, I need to show you guys this like This moment that we have right here in the PR box Look how pretty that is. This is the lipstick collection and then also the um, Highlighter duo so we have three glosses inside the collection. We have aura which is the lightest one We also have the middle one is tiger eye and then the third one is called secret and then finally we have this guy, which is the highlighter duo. So pretty. Ooh, 
okay, so we have a deeper bronzy highlight and then a lighter, almost I would say like um, a champagne-y rose gold. Ooh. Ooh, do you guys see that shine? So as you guys, eh, as you guys can tell, super excited about this. Thank you so much to KKW Beauty for sending us over and also congrats for the amazing collab. All right, so we actually have some uh, lashes from Lily Lashes that I want to show you guys. So they sent over a couple of my favorite style, which is the style Hollywood. I use this style all the time for like glammed up looks. This even looks good if you cut a bit off for like an everyday look, if you're not gonna wear like eyeshadow and stuff, but you still want your lashes to be popping. So they sent over a couple Hollywood. Um, then this guy is called Ella, and it's nice and wispy. We have Lila here, so extra Miami. And then these ones are a bit lighter. Um, this one is called Royalty, if you can see that. Definitely a lot lighter if you compare the two. Like, dang girl, that's some natch snatch kind of kind of ish. And then we have the style lavish. So thank you to Lily Lashes for sending those over. Honestly, I just like I always love getting socked up on lashes because you guys know I'm such a lash girl. Like I never really feel like my looks complete. Like I would rather be wearing no makeup like today or full makeup, full glam, lashes, everything. You know? Okay. Hokey dokey. Next up we have <laughs> When I unboxed this, I literally screamed. Like, I was like, oh my god, this is the cutest little thing. It's a little avocado. I think this is actually to, like, hold avocados um, so that they don't go bad. Like, if you just use half or something, you can keep the rest in here, I think. Don't quote me, but I think that that's what it's for. Um, but in here, we have two products from Kiehl's. So, Kiehl's sent this over. Thank you to Kiehl's. Um, and this is part of their, like, avocado line. So, we have this guy, which is the Avocado Nourishing Hydration Mask. I think this is a new product, actually. So, I'm really excited to try it out and just get my skin glowing. And then we have the Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment, which is kind of like a cult fave. A lot of people have tried this, I'm sure. And I've... I, I've tried this a long time ago, but I actually haven't used it in a long time. So I will let you know. I'll report back. But thank you, Kiehl's, for sending over literally the cutest little avocado package. Um, they also included this, which I'm actually not really sure what this is. But I almost think it's like to cut the avocado and then like... I don't know. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, I don't know. I'll figure it out. But thank you to Kiehl's. <laughs> I literally can't get over it. There. Boom. Lock and freshness. All right, I thought I would open this guy on camera, um, but every year Sigma does a collection, or not a collection, but like, I guess you could say a launch. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. They do like a little something something for Bright Pink, which is um, a really amazing breast cancer organization. So this year, we're gonna see. So cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So this is their new 3DHD Perfection Complexion Set. It comes with a 3DHD sponge, a 3DHD foundation brush, which is actually bomb. And this one is like this really pretty metallic pink shade. And then also um, a, a bag to, to hold them. A makeup brush slash, a makeup slash brush bag. Wow, I cannot read. <laughs> So pretty. 20% of proceeds gets donated to Bright Pink, which I think is amazing. And not only is it just freaking adorable, like how cute is this brush? But you're obviously, you know, part of your money is going towards a good cause, which I think is just amazing. And then this is the sponge. I'm sure you guys have seen me use a 3D HD, um, but just this is just like a different color. And then this is the bag. So cute! Thank you to Sigma for sending this over. And, um... Let me know, I guess, if you guys want me to link it. Oh, it's available today. It literally just launched October 1st, so it's available today. Let me know if you guys want me to link anything for you guys down below, I guess, um, because I can totally link that um, if you guys want to check it out. Boom. I feel like this is so fun. I was going to say cute, but like I, I realize now that I'm saying cute a lot to a lot of this stuff, even though it is cute. So I feel like you guys are probably getting annoyed. So this is fun, but it's also, you know, the C word, the 
C-U-T-E, not the other C word, okay? Uh, but anyways, so it says, where's my phone? This is from ColourPop, and they actually, it looks like they sent over a bunch of single shadows, which I actually didn't even know that they had. So they have single shadows in here. We have a ton of them. A little palette to put them in. Um, let me just put these in and then I'll show you guys. Ooh, so all of these are actually pressed glitters. I don't know if you guys can tell like how how chunky they are, but chunky kind of like in a good way, like if you're looking for a chunky glitter. Um, they're really cool. I've never really seen anything like this. Like, yeah, that is like a straight up glitter. It almost feels like it has some kind of like silicone -y base for it to like stick on my hand without like any, um, you know, primer or mixing gel or anything. So they have a bunch of these liners that are super bright. We also have a purple shadow, which is in the shade Seeing Stars. And then we have this green in, a, in an orange. It's like they like mix match like all the shades with the packaging. So the green is in the orange container and this one is called Keep Scrolling. But this one actually says Festival Packing List. I think that this package might have gotten lost on accident because obviously I've done unboxing since then. Um, but there was like a weird time where like some packages were going to like the studio and some packages were going here and like some were just getting misplaced. So I'm so, so sorry for not sharing that earlier, but thank you to ColourPop for sending that over. <laughs> um, and you know what, honestly, I'm still gonna use them. I'm always in like in search of colorful or like cool liners because I feel like they can really change up a look, but also for Halloween coming up, I'm not ready at all for Halloween, so I don't know. I was kind of like, you know, okay, girl, because I'm not ready at all. I don't have, like, I don't have any looks finalized. I have some in my head that I might do, but nothing that's, like, for sure, like, a bomb, like, I'm gonna drop some heat, you know what I mean? But I'm working on it. If you guys, literally you guys, if you have any requests for Halloween tutorials or Halloween videos or Halloween looks that you guys want me to do, please let me know, please, because I am, I need inspiration. For that okay oh my god i just saw oh, i thought i saw a big spider but it was really just like a fuzzy you know <laughs> anyways um so moving like literally across the whole spectrum doing a complete 180 holiday kits already started coming out so this is the tarte cosmetics holiday kit it's called tarte treasures it's so cute because it has this star detailing, which you know, love me some stars for my rock stars. Um, so in here, you're gonna get a eyeshadow palette. Well, actually it's an eyeshadow and face palette, a mascara, and then a brush. So I'll open this up and show you guys. I cannot believe literally hol holiday products are already dropping. Ooh, oh, oh, this, oh, this is like, oh. Oh, they said that's how we gonna do it this holiday season. Okay, if I could do it while showing you guys, that'd be awesome. Okay, this actually looks really, really beautiful. I feel like they put a lot of warm neutrals, which I like and appreciate. I've actually always really liked um, Tarte eyeshadows. I feel like they've always done a pretty good job for the most part. I did feel like sometimes there's like inconsistencies, like some oh wow that matte just kind of gave me life right there because it was super super buttery um i know in the past some of their like more cardboard palettes have been like a little different formulas than their like metal palettes but the tartlet palette the tartlet and bloom like bomb palettes i still use them to this day and they released like how many years ago now um let me do this highlighter do you guys remember exposed i wonder if one of these is exposed because exposed highlight was like all the rage back in the day you know what this reminds me of well first of all this would be a really good christmas gift i didn't even show the rest but you also get this mascara which is in a cute like limited edition rose gold packaging and then also this dual ended brush as well um that you could use i believe that's probably like a blush and you could probably use that for uh, highlight or the eyeshadow. This kind of reminds me of Thanksgiving. Like the actual eyeshadow colors remind me of Thanksgiving. So super cute. Tarte Holiday 2019. Already dropping. Okay, this one I was so excited about because I've actually been wanting to try this product forever. Um, but I just never got around to it. But Morphe actually sent this over because the... 
boom all these p louise bases they actually sell these now at morphe which is very exciting because um this is actually a brand from the uk which is why i personally never got around to purchasing it i don't know i just get kind of like not scared but like i just don't know like i don't know how it's gonna come i don't know if it's gonna get stopped i just don't know you know so it's, it's kind of like uncertain for me so it's kind of cool that they're actually now selling them in morphe or probably also on morphe.com as well um but yeah these are basically eyeshadow bases they have so many different shades and from what i've seen and the reason that i really wanted to try these is they are full pigment like you can't get more full pigment than this from what I've seen. So I'm going to test these for sure. Let me just swatch one because I just want to see the consistency and stuff. But you know I'm going to be testing these out. I, did you hear that sound? Why is it like separating like that? Let me try it on a different part. Is it because I put like all that other stuff on? Hold on, hold on, hold up. Hold up, that is not what I've seen on Instagram. I've honestly, I've seen makeup artists do like crazy stuff with this particular base. So I'm kind of like, okay, what? Okay, okay, I feel like I had something here because now it's like blending out normally. Like full coverage, AF, canceling out discoloration. Yeah, I'm excited. That was kind of weird though, how it like at first didn't. I like kind of separated, I mean. <laughs> so yeah, thank you to Morphe for sending this over and also congrats for now selling this in stores. I'm super, super excited. Even though it kind of separated on me at first, I'm actually really excited to try it, so. So, um, I don't know if you guys have heard, but ColourPop actually released like a brand new line of stuff, which is called Pretty Fresh. And I believe it's like more of like a skincare slash skincare makeup kind of line. Um, so I know they have like, see, they have like primer, they have setting mist, but they have these HA tinted moisturizers, which is like the number one thing that I actually heard about. Cause I think it's supposed to be like, basically like super hydrating, hyaluronic acid, um, skin tints basically. All I really know about this is that it's supposed to be super, super, super hydrating. Like, like the most hydrating kind of tinted moisturizer, ugh, moisturizer you've ever tried in your life. Um, should I try one on? Cause I don't have anything on. Actually no, cause I'm going to the doctor's appointment. So I don't think I should. But um, honestly, stay tuned. Stay tuned, honey bums. This is what the packaging looks like. It has like a nice little squeezy squeeze at the bottom. And we're just gonna, oh. It doesn't really smell like anything, but it is really, lightweight you can tell even like right away right when you put this on the back of your hand that it's super lightweight and it says on the side of the package that ha stands for hyaluronic acid but it also has coconut water and it's going to be ideal for all skin types but basically it's known to hydrate and support healthy looking skin and the coconut water is known to support hydration and skin softness so i think that's basically what they're going for with this whole line the pretty fresh line is like hydration softness glowy lightweight i'm super excited to try this i'm kind of sad that i can't try it out right now because that would have been cool to like try it on camera for the first time um like right here right now like candid just just so spur of the moment kind of vibes but i don't think i can because the doctor has to like look at my skin today so um i don't think she would be very happy if i went in and um and had tinted moisturizer on and she was like, oh, your skin looks super clear. And then I was like, but I am super excited to try this. Ooh, I can try this though. This is the Pretty Fresh HA Setting Mist. So it's gonna have hyaluronic uh, acid in it. Ooh, ooh, honey. Oh, that smells good. It literally smells like butter bronzer. Like, you know that like coconutty, uh, very summery scent. Like it almost smells like a little bit like sunscreen, but not like super sunscreeny. It's like, just like a sprinkle of sunscreen. That's what this smells like. It smells super good. So it's basically just a hyaluronic acid setting mist. Um, it doesn't have much info on it, but it is dermatologist tested, oil-free, gluten-free, paraben-free, vegan. And it basically says it's a micro fine refreshing setting mist that hydrates for healthy looking skin. Shake well, hold six to eight inches away from face, close eyes and mist directly onto the skin. Use after makeup or mist throughout the day. And again, it has that hyaluronic acid and coconut water and then there's also the hydrating um ha primer 
as well. Okay, honestly, I'm sorry if this is like super bright. I like literally don't know how to use this camera like at all. So this is from Tatcha and like, is that not like the prettiest thing you've ever seen? On the top, it says, I love blank and inside, oh. <laughs> They included a little Sharpie so you can write on the top, which I feel like these are just handy to have, you know, on hand. But they actually included the Silk Peony. I'm gonna try this out. Oh, you guys, oh my gosh. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this because of this light, but inside of the cap, there's, I don't know if that's like a real flower, but there's like a flower, like, Very fresh. Tatcha's products always smell super fresh. This is a little eye cream to keep your under eyes hydrated. I keep eye creams everywhere. Like I keep one um, on my desk while I'm editing. I keep one obviously in the bathroom. I keep like two or three in there. And then I even had one in my purse for a while because if I'm not wearing makeup, I just like to keep my eye area as hydrated pos as possible through the day just so I don't get as many wrinkles like preventative measures you know what i mean but yeah this is so beautiful so thank you so much to tatcha for sending over this gorgeous little package also um my camera had cut off but thank you to ColourPop for sending this over because i will definitely be trying all this out and uh giving you guys a full-on review once i've tested everything and next up we have way the super dry shampoo I actually love the way Whey products. Oh. oh no, 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 no. I love the way Whey products smell, but it just kind of. Ooh, she's voluminous. Whoa. Do you guys hear that? <laughs> but here we go. Also, guys, I've been using the Revlon um, that. You know, you know what I'm talking about. The styling thing that I used in my Target transformation video, like Target makeover video, and I'm hooked. I feel like I cannot go back to like any other way of blow drying my hair. I just love how like voluminized my hair always looks whenever I use it, but it's it's super, super easy and quick. So I love that Revlon thing, but also thank you to Way for sending this over. Okay, you guys, wait. I've been zoomed in this whole time. Okay, I'm about to be so late for my appointment, but I I should have left so long ago already. But I want to show you guys some of the other products. So I think I'm just going to take you and show you like in the little piles so that you guys can see. Um, oh, I almost forgot to show you guys this, but uh, Fenty Beauty sent over a couple little goodies and I actually have a few more over there. So first we have the Instant Retouch Concealer, Mattifying Primer, and then the Soft Matte Longwear Foundation, which these have been out. So I think this was just a restock, so thank you to Fenty Beauty. Murad actually sent over this uh, Invisascar Resurfacing Treatment, which is supposed to be good for um, fading scars and stuff. So I'll definitely try that out. I really love Murad's products again Because for skincare, I just want to see a difference in my skin Like I don't want it to just feel good at first and then not feel like anything later And Murad is one of the brands that I do see a difference in my skin and then over here This is where all the other Fenty Beauty stuff was so we have this new primer which is actually a hydrating primer, which excites me because I love anything that says hydration. So this is um, kind of like, you know, just the sister, the sister sister to the matte primer. This is now the new hydrating one. And they also actually came out with a hydrating foundation as well. So I'll show you guys that. So this is their hydrating foundation. I have heard a lot of good things um, about it. They sent over a couple different shades. So I'll probably be testing them out. But I do like the packaging a lot. It's really like sleek, but it still feels super like high quality, if that makes sense. Um, they also sent over a few brushes also some travel items i think these were from separate packages but i'm just going to show you guys together since it's all from the same brand so this is a mini i love minis this is a mini of the matte primer i just died so now i'm filming this on my phone so hopefully it's still good quality because i've never really filmed um anything on my phone as far as like a full-on youtube video so anyways we have the little bronze duo which is a mini bronzer and then also a mini matchstick which is i think one of the highlighting ones i love these bronzers though so this is so cute i want to open this up oh there they are it's so cute it's so 
obviously they're little minis. Okay, when I tell you this is literally the cutest thing of my life, I'm not lying. Um, and then this is the mini matchstick as well. And they actually sent this little fanny pack, which I thought was super cute. And we have a mini setting powder, which, oh my God, this is literally so handy. Like I feel like this out of anything is gonna come in so clutch because I feel like setting powders always take up so much room in my makeup bag. So this is perfect to have a little mini size. I actually had a mini before, I believe, but I dropped it and everything came out. So this is the sizing. It's literally smaller than my the palm of my hand. Thank you so much to Fenty for sending this over. I'm super excited to try out though the new like hydrating complexion products and then also for traveling coming up and stuff. I'm going to New York soon, so I'll, I'll be able to like, you know, take these little bad boys with me. Somebody just called me and I'm kind of freaking out because I'm really late for my doctor's appointment now, but I'm like just trying to get as much as I can done so I can show you guys. I cannot tell you how excited I am for this package right here. This is from Baddie B Lashes. You guys know one of my favorite lash companies. Let me try to open it because there's no way. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Ah! There we go. So this is one of their newest styles, which is called IG. I'm gonna take you out of the sun so you can really see how it looks. So this is called IG. So pretty, very wispy. Um, if you guys have not tried Baddie B lashes, they are so bomb. My favorites are probably Insta Ho, Baddie, and Sugar Baby. Um, I mean, I've talked about this before, but just you know, letting you guys know. And if you wanna try these out, I do have a discount code with them. So I will leave that in the description box if you guys wanna check them out. But usually my discount codes are like Roxette Arisa or Roxette pretty much. So you can, you know, try that if, <laughs> if you want to. All right, you guys, that is all I have time for today because I literally am gonna be so late for this appointment. Um, and they literally were like, don't come late, actually come 15 minutes early. <laughs> and I'm still here. So, and it's in actually 12 minutes. So um, there's that, but I have to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so, so much with all of my heart. And again, thank you literally from the bottom of my heart like i would not be able to have you know these opportunities or work with these amazing brands without you guys so i just want to say thank you again because i truly do love you guys so much and thank you to elf also for working with me throughout this year and on the brand campaign that is it for me make sure to subscribe i upload every wednesday and sunday and i will see you in my next video please pray for me so that i'm not they don't kill me that i'm so late <laughs> love you guys bye